Hey guys, welcome to the Bremen family. So today we're going to be giving you a house tour of our fabulous home. So stay tuned. Hi. set up right there and then I have a closet if I need to change for like a quick meeting I have a closet with all of my clothes there and this is our beautiful Poirier um, we designed it ourselves got it from um, some kind of magazine um, some time ago but yeah this is our wonderful Poirier so as you know the kitchen is the heart of the home so let's check out our fabulous kitchen I do Kenzie's hair here. This is our little beauty shop here. We're not big drinkers usually. We just have this for guests, you know, when they come over. So here's our little bar area here in the kitchen. This is where I do all of my chopping. So I have this little spot here for my chopping the onions and things like that. So yeah, this area I have my rice cooker, of course. And you know, sometimes you get tired of being in an office and so you want to just get out and get a new change of scenery. I have my computer here. I know a lot of people don't have second desk. This is my second desk where I do all of my work. Cole, Kenzie, and I, we're very fabulous. So we don't have a lot of room in our closet. So we decided to just make a closet right here. So this is where we put all of our extra clothes, designer items, and things like that. And this is our living room. in and we talk and we discuss like what we're going to show you guys for YouTube. We have our dining room table here and I also use this area for editing as you can see and this is where Cole works. Um, sometimes we have our printer right there. So Kenzie, this is where Kenzie does homeschool and this is where I do it too. So. How I use it. And you know ergonomics is very important in our house. We want to make sure that our, our backs are secured and so this is the best way for me to work, you know. We're gonna show you where all the magic happens. Welcome to where all the magic happens. So guys, this is our bedroom. This is a master suite. A California king was too small for us. So we decided to be creative. So we got a queen size bed and we also have a twin size bed. So Kenzie and Cole sleeps here and I sleep here. And so this is how we make it work and you know, we're getting um, sheets that are gonna be custom made for this. Right now we have to use different sets of sheets, but we're gonna get custom made sheets on the way. Mm -hmm. We have what they call the Aeronomics 2.0. Some people call it an air mattress, how tacky. This is the Aeronomics 2.0 um, and the Aeronomics 2.1. We have a snack area right here. Yeah, this is where we eat some of our snacks. Yummy. <laughs> So guys, this is it. This is my beautiful closet. It's so much, I have a lot of room here. Got so many clothes. So I keep my um, dresser um, here. So this is where I store my clothes. And so of course, you know, we're moving to Austin and you know, I have a lot of sweaters and you know, clothes for the snow. So what I did was I emptied this out and I'm getting upgraded clothes, you know, for me for the Austin weather. So it's, it's looking a little empty now, but you guys know me, of course, it's coming. This is it. I had one Louis bag. <laughs> I decided to upgrade to three. I know you guys are wondering, how does she do her makeup so beautiful? You're like, her lighting must be really great. You're right about that. You're right about that. Yeah. This is my bathroom, guys. This is where I get my makeup done. So we have a makeup artist that come every day for me, and so I get my makeup done here. This is primarily it, so I'm gonna go ahead now and have Cole show you his man cave. Hey guys, I bet you're missing me. I'm about to show you an exclusive peek at my man cave that I have here in the home. You're gonna get blown away. Don't be too jealous, come on with me. 
Check this out. I know, I know what y'all thinking. I got so much space down here, man. Yeah. I can play football down here, like, <laughs> and then you can drop back for a pass. Then you can run. Touchdown! All right, so as you guys can see, play a lot of sports, a lot of activities down here. You really gotta stay in shape. As you can tell, my physique, you should be able to notice that I do hit the weight room pretty hard, and I take my health serious. So what I'm gonna show you right now is a glimpse into my workout room. This is exclusive equipment, so don't try and touch anything, please. Don't try to steal anything. Just take a look, please. And I know I'm giving you a preview, so you just need to relax. So over here, this is the jumping jack area. Okay. All right. So this one here, it's all about the plyometrics, jumping, you know, so we just we work it, work it really good that way. And then if you want to switch it up, you can do like football move where you like, and do quick feet. A lot of, you know, a lot of people do their push-ups, um, you know, right on the ground. Well, I like to, you know, go ahead and use the wall here. So I'll go like this and I'll do my push-ups like this. The nice thing is that I got so many machines here that I can just go to the next machine if that one's busy. And I just go like this again. All right, and then over here, this area, as you can see this pipe, what I use it for is it's my, it's my gut check as you say. Um, so this is where I really tell if I'm in shape. Um, what I do is, come on, come on, come on. I bring it down, bring it down. I get right through that hole right there and crawl right through there. And that's gonna tell me if I'm in the shape that I wanna be in for, for my sports activity. You know, the pipe's being repaired, so if I bump it, it might come off and water go everywhere, so it's just not a good time, otherwise I'd definitely show this you. This area right here is all about the lateral, you know, you run back and forth. If you wanna step back, I'll show you a little bit. Um, what we do is we do slide like this, all the way across, all the way back, just like that. And you touch the wall if you want to, to be honest with you. And then finally, this is the last part of the workout room that I'm gonna expose you to today. Um, so that's right here, guys. Just go ahead, walk right through. This is my meditation area. This is where I calm myself. If I wanna get away and just get in my own personal space, I go ahead and just have a seat in here and I uh, just relax. So that's that's it guys. Right. Well, next let me show you the locker room. Man, I love this space. So when I'm done sweat, get my sweat on in the, in the equipment room there, as you saw, uh, I go ahead and hop in the shower, get a fresh from my day. Um, it does have spa-like features. Most people think this is the normal shower, uh, but I'll tell you right here, this shower head has more no nozzles or nodules than uh, most shower heads, so it's really comforting. Plus, what you don't see is what really is the difference maker, and that's all the body jets that come right out of the side here. So as you turn this on, I'm not gonna do that because we're gonna get wet, um, they would just like like back up, open up, and then all of a sudden the body jets would come forward, and it starts spraying you, so. And then the last thing I want to show you guys is this room here. This is my man cave bonus room. What you're looking at here is just a beautiful waterfall that they installed um, for, the, for our home. Um, and we had that custom made when we moved in. We asked them to put that in. Uh, so, you know, when it rains, we're going to see a beautiful pour down that, down that wall. And occasionally it even comes right in to give you that first person, you know, feel. So after I'm done with the workout, Sometimes I'll come in here and I'll just go ahead and um, you know kind of go swimming if you will. I'll lay down on the carpet and I'll just go ahead and roll a little bit like this. I, I do advise that you take another shower just due to the chlorine that's going to be in that water. Um, but I do use this also as a getaway from you know those times that it's not quite clicking with uh, the spouse. So what I'll do is I'll take my aer aerodynamic 2.0 bed upstairs. I'll bring that down since it's basically air. And I'll toss it in here and um, just basically use this as my getaway. And the nice thing is the room is big enough that I could even pop in a tent in here. So when my wife does not want to go camping, I'll go ahead and pop the tent up and I'll say, Kenzie, you want to go camping? And she'll be like, yeah! And then she'll come in here and we'll have the whole tent set up and it'll be a nice little getaway. And guys, I can bring my thinking back in here and go get camping. Well, you want to go camping tonight? Yeah! All right, we're doing camping tonight. But of course, we gotta ask your mom first, okay? 